All right, so he said, oh yeah, we it's marked exactly where he is. So I just need to make my way up to there. Go take out uh, my third divine beast. Take out the rain. And then we will uh, go explore those peaks that they want me to explore. Just in the wrong order, because I believe I have zero, yeah, 56 shock arrows. They recommended having 20. So we're good. We're A-OK. -okay. Looks like the, there's a bridge that takes you out of here. Is that, is that the one? Whoa. Loud noises. Oh, a shock arrow. Yeah! Ah! Uh. Eddie Mifa, watch this! I second the aptly named Demon Sergeant. Sergeant shall strike down the divi Divine Beast Varuta. What you doing? Huh? You. You're Link! Finally. I can avenge Lady Mifa. Been a hundred years since you last showed your face. Now I, Sagan, will cut you down myself. What do you mean? <laughs> Playing dumb, eh? Nice try, but you cannot fool me, Champion Link. You're unable to pr protect Lady Mifa from Calabity Geddon. <sighs> it's been 100, 100 years since we lost her. Poor Lady Mifa, how heartbreaking. I won't fail her again. <laughs> huh? There's no way we, we would ask you, for, uh, ask for your help now. After all the time, and after all that has happened. So says I, Sagan, the Demon Sergeant. Even if this body of mine is destroyed, I will drown Ruta and Shock Arrows myself. And in doing so, Lady Mifa's regrets shall be alleviated. You underestimate anything of courage? If you understand anything of courage, then get out of my way at once. And so he's just grabbing the Shock Arrow and trying to grab it over and over again as it keeps hurting him. Look, I can pick it up. Hey! I am in the middle of my shock arrow training. I must learn to withstand them. Did I not just tell you that? To commit such violence with the great Sagan standing right before you. In that case, you take the responsibility of appeasing the Divine Beast Varuta. Huh. Huh. Well, he changed his mind fast. That worked out. Hey, I... Got him to stop mutilating himself. Hooray. Or I did that one. Well, well, it's always nice to have a visitor here. Thank you for journeying to our fair Zora's domain. Wait a moment, you. You're Link. The perpetrator who forced Lady Mifa to join his crusade 100 years ago. Only to be destroyed by Calamity Ganon. As though I could ever forget that face. You should know that the elder, elderly here who loved Lady Mifa still remember, and they still resent you. I, however, resent the deed and not the person. I also believe in allowing the mistakes of the past to wash away. Link, I have retired from my role as a priest. I am now living my life free from the material concerns of this world. However, ever since I retired, each day is more boring than the last. Spending day after day in idleness only to pass from this world soon. Link, as I'm sure you are well aware, the, the afterlife lays, cl lays claim to all. We never know when it will beckon. If during your travels you meet any engaged couples, I would like you to introduce them to me. Joining two souls is a true honor. One I shall stake my life on. Just one more wedding and I shall be fulfilled. Engaged couples... Also, that didn't... Weird, that, weird how that, that didn't become a quest. But I've encountered... Oh, look, children. I've encountered multiple couples, haven't I? There's the couple that got attacked, and I defended them, and then there was... You know, even their barrels are fish. They have fish pots. Fish pots! Link, why? <laughs> uh, there was the couple I brought together at the romance place, where that guy got really into that... into being around that Gerudo lady. Good morning. Uh, who are you? I'm Hylian. Oh. So if you're Hylian, did you come from far away? I ask because my... Oh, never mind. My dad told me not to talk to strangers. Right, well, that's that. Do you only have a general store in an inn, or have I just not discovered the rest? I should pay a visit to the store before I leave. Although, if they sell any shockers there, my main response will be, How? 
Ice arrows. Regular arrows. Actually, I don't really need to buy those anymore. I have 258. For once, that's not as reasonable of a choice now. Swift Violet. Hi. I've got food. Trout and stuff. Not the biggest priority stuff. Do you have a cooking spot in here? This is where you were. What are you chiseling at? So, the Hylian who stole Lady Mifo away thinks he can just come wandering in here like nothing happened. What business do you have here after all these years? What is this place? The Weapons Workshop. What are you doing? Trident maintenance? A trident? The light scale trident and the ceremonial trident. You've been making a racket since you walked in here. There's no point to coming in here if you do not possess the light scale trident. Now leave now. Oh. I had one of those a minute ago, didn't I? Well, now I'm curious. I am the curious about what might happen if I had a light scale trident. But my inventory is full of stuff I don't want to lose. Dang it. I mean, I have so many two-handed weapons. I can I can probably get rid of a dragon bone moblin club to sate my my curiosity, unless I want to get rid of the guardian spear. Let's do the spear. Bye. You live on the floor now. I am going to go right back in there and get that trident, which should still be there. I'll show you, meaningless. I'm going to grab that trident, and I'm going to take it to you, and then you'll have to talk to me more. <laughs> Begrudgingly. Do you get turned off if I do this? Yep. That's all it takes. Oh, God. That was almost bad. Wait, how does this work? I don't understand. Weird, they go from being on to turning off. Do they turn off if I come up here? Is that what the puzzle, the mechanic is here? It might be that just reaching the top turns them off. Because, like, those were a bunch of shuttles before. Those were a bunch of open things, and now they're all closed. I think they were all open a second ago. Oh, silver scale spear. Crap. Welp. Uh, this may have been a waste of time. Because I'm a genius. That never makes mistakes. That's not a bright scale trident, it's a silver scale spear. They're completely different, and no one could ever confuse them against, uh, with each other, except unless there was some kind of idiot with pointy ears. But they don't make those. <laughs> well, so if I find a special trident, I can apparently take it there, and maybe he'd work on it? A trident? Yeah, the light scale trident. Yep. Yep. Well. I get to have a funny looking spear now. Aha. Is it better now? This one has critical hit. Did you just get startled? Oops, sorry. Sorry for attacking the area around you. All is as it should be. So here I could cook. Ah! I'm so mad at her. I need to go to the Bank of Wishes to send a letter. But Mother won't let me go because of that water monster. She treats me like I'm still a child. It's so condescending. It's really terrible to be that awkward Zora age where I'm a young woman, but I haven't had my growth spurt yet. Just my luck to be a late bloomer. I'll probably never grow taller. Ugh, it's awful to be me sometimes. I doubt Hylians have to deal with nonsense like this since you since you age so fast. You're so lucky that we die fast. Yay. Letter? Whenever I put a letter in a bottle and send it to down Zora River, I always get a reply without fail. I wonder what he's like. The one responding to my letters. I want to meet him so badly. Do you need anything else? Bank of wishes. 
The Bank of Wishes is halfway down Zora River. If you send a letter down the river from the Bank of Wishes and get a reply, the person will be yours forever. That's how the legend goes, anyway. Who are you? I'm Finley. All the other girls are are head over flippers for Princess for Prince Sidon, but not me. I believe everyone has their own special prince out there just waiting for them. I wonder if I can find the other person and like they'd get together or something. I don't know. Probably too young to get engaged though. Although I don't really know what to make. You you're Master Link from a hundred years ago. Sorry, back to work I go. We're always happy to provide some sleep for the weary travelers. Welcome to see bed in. And then the usual resting stuff is here. Water bed? Oh, I should have checked that, huh? Is that a third variant of bed then, or is it just a, their version of the comfortable bed? Let's double check. Okay, no, it's just the same thing, I think. They have their own variant of the higher level bed. I need to do some cooking pretty badly. Please raise your maximum hearts. Click. That's pretty much what I need then. But I can make it more powerful if I want to. But for now, it functions as a full heal, right? That's probably the best way to go. Yeah. It's not a, it's not a good bonus heart item. But it gives me full heal every time, and I have so many hearts that that's the bulk now. I have to make some really powerful stuff, and I'd have to make a really powerful bonus heart item in order to get a lot of bonus hearts at this point. But, uh... I can do this. This'll help. I'm going to have a supply of healing items. Already. I didn't really mean to add more, but it doesn't really matter. Ta-da! Those hearts... Or those apples were wasted. I probably won't need this many. Because it really feels like this dungeon is meant to be the first one. But hey, I haven't cooked for a long time, so... I need to stop being irresponsible and actually do some cooking for once. Hey, now I've got a whole bunch of bonus heart items. That should suffice for now. When I come back after doing Vaharuta, I'll probably cook the other types of truffles. But I don't want to spend too much time staring at the cooking screen in one episode. Alright. Really, yeah, there's a weird lack of shops around here for a major city compared to the, uh, the Zora and the Gerudo. I'm wondering if maybe when I uh, take care of the major problem they have, if suddenly there a bunch of shops will open up, and maybe that's how you kind of like unlock the town properly. Unless I've just failed to discover them, and that's why they're not on the map. I don't really remember having to dis discover them one by one before, though. I, I feel like I just went into town and they were there. What's he doing? Oh, it's Segan. You, Link! Though I lack the shock arrows needed for the job, I am on my way to take on the Divine Beast Varuta all by myself. Do not try to stop me, Link. Good luck. Ha 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 ha. That is the very last thing I wish to hear from you. Still, according to my fortune today, I should be cautious of injury. In light of that, I think it would be for the best if I call it a day. <laughs> well, that's not really going anywhere, is it? Alright, well, nice to take a break from this town where everybody kind of hates me. For the best. I believe this is where- yep. This should be the ladder- the staircase that takes me to the top of the dam. Which- which is the- apparently exactly where the beast is, as I predicted. Not that it's really a hard prediction. It's just a big, menacing lake overlooking the main city. Doing its thing. Ooh! You got chests around here? Uh, that one... That one's fallen over. Oh, it's a night shield. Do I have a crappy shield? Not really. 
I keep holding on to the Lionel Shield on based on some weird assumption that I'm gonna actually ever use it for the purpose of uh for the purpose of uh, blocking an attack. Or like it's like as like a reflection that will damage its target. But so far I've never actually tried to use it really. Alright, how good do you feel about this, Sidon? I'm sure we're gonna be fine. Switch to the proper setup. I just like I just like looking at the knight shield more than the guardian one. Huh. Glad to see you're ready to go, Link. His teeth make a rupee glint. <laughs> Are you ready for this? Do you have your Zora armor and enough shock arrows? I'm ready. <laughs> Wonderful. You never cease to amaze, Link. Now then, let us go and appease that divine beast as one. Here we go. Hmm. Gaze upon the divine beast's back. Do you see those glowing pink orbs? You will need to shoot each of them with a shock arrow. With your Zora armor, you now have the ability to ascend waterfalls. So I shall take you right up to the side of the Divine Beast, and from there you can swim up and take aim. I know you can do it. I believe in you. Now hurry up and get on my back. Get on my back. Ride me! Good answer. Let's get going. Okay, here we go. Ha! I am, an uns I am unstoppable in the water. Ruda is responding to our presence. I'll move away and wait for an opening before we approach. I'm going at full speed. It's up for you to ward off Ruda atta Ruda's attacks. Are you ready? Divine Beast Ruda will undoubtedly see it, use its ancient and mysterious power that includes hurting, hur uh, hurling I giant ice blocks that we need to... Okay. Well. Do I just freeze them? Or... <laughs> Oops. Oh. I don't know what he's... What did he say? Do I swing at it? No? Okay. So I get for trying to read things out loud is I don't know... I don't... I didn't get to see what it said. Uh... Can I just use the normal arrow? Oop. Nope. Okay. Really wish I had seen what he said I was supposed to do. Crap. What happened to press A to proceed? <laughs> That's how every conversation works. Uh, uh. The bomb arrows don't work. Okay. Really wish I knew what I was supposed to be doing right now. You can't use Magnesis, right? They're not... They're clearly not. Cryonis? Oh, there we go. Ta-da! Oh. I'm somehow missing it? There we go. Ah. Uh, here they come! Ah! Uh, did I miss? Where is he? There we go. Gotcha. They're honestly not very damaging ice blocks. I'm not overly concerned. That would have been great if I managed to get both of them at once. Alright, well I see the loop we're doing now. Oh, okay, those are probably more dangerous. That's probably why we did this. This is probably- they're probably ramping it up. That's why the first ones didn't seem dangerous, is because they're gonna throw spike balls at me later. That's a bit more violent. Come 
come on. Uh oh, I don't think I did it. Uh oh. How did I miss that? Oh, I created ice on accident. Turn it back on. There we go. There we go. Uh, wrong waterfall, I think. Yeah, go back around. See, Don, what are you doing? We're not, aren't we on the wrong side? I thought. Yeah, this is the wrong side. You dummy. That's not gonna reach. Maybe if I glide over. Aha! <laughs> I outsmarted the game. <laughs> wow, that was astounding. <laughs> Link, look. The water spouting from Ruta has slowed down. The root is floating higher now. You wanted to venture inside of it, right? I'll bring you closer. We're counting on you, hero. Do good work in there. Well, Link, here we are. Looks like this is where the real work starts. Best of luck. Nice job cutting off the water flow from this divine beast. Show the enemy no fear. I'll see you back at Zora's domain. Farewell. I find myself wondering why there's so little voice acting. Because this was, that was like one of the hyped features, or not really, I don't know about hyped, but it was one of the things that came up early beforehand. It's like, oh, there's going to be voice acting in a Zelda game. <gasps> Crazy. And it's like 30 seconds of voice acting per kingdom, basically, besides the uh, memories. Not that the voice acting is great, so maybe it's for the best. <laughs> stone there contains the information that you will need. That's interesting. They have the usual blocking point, like always, that's trying to stop you from getting through here without... Nope. Without a... Yeah. This thing's always here to, like, try to stop you from getting through to make sure you know how to destroy them. But for the first time, I think I can just, yeah, I can just get past it without ever doing that. Can I just melee it? Yep. But yeah, like, I can just sneak past it for once, which is unusual. Normally, you have to specifically get it, you have to destroy it to get past it in most of the dungeons. I think, I think it's meant to be a tutorial. Making sure you know that you can destroy those. <laughs> Well, thanks for coming by. If 
That'll destroy that. Oh, right. That cleared the path, but that didn't get rid of the fact that there's still a gate in the way. Unless I can go under it. Oh, there's a whole... Oh, there's a path here. So no need for the cryonis anyway. Not that it would be hard to swim regardless, but I like to... create things I can walk on when I get the option. So I can spin that around to grab that canister. Shouldn't be that hard. In fact, it might even be... magnetic? Yeah. This is awkward. Down. Down. Is that as far as it'll go or something? That doesn't seem accessible. I guess it is. There are four terminals remaining. Don't give up. Yeah, it didn't, didn't seem like I'd moved it far enough yet, uh, but I guess I did. I was trying to make it up to the top level, but it seemed like it was stuck, like I couldn't move it anymore. Not really sure. What's this outline mean? Something that can fall on me? Or maybe there's a big block that has to be located that w in that spot? Because there are definitely like big, big blocks in the game that you get. This is the main control. As per usual, it looks a lot like the uh, great fairies. Speaking of which, did I ever get my fairies or did I forget? That's actually concerning. Uh, uh oh. I think I forgot to visit the fairy. I don't see fairies in here. What's Lon Lon Milk do again? Alright, it's not called Lon Lon in this game, it's just called Milk. So it's probably not even the same thing. Yeah, unless I'm overlooking it, I don't think there is a fairy in here. Whoopsie. Yeah, I also had enough spirit things to turn in to level up one more time. Well, Kinda skipped my mind there. It's fine. I'll just have to make sure I don't run out of health. Uh, cause I will die. We'll just see how much you can accomplish before you have to start transforming this place. Hi there, how you doing? Thank you. Innards, please. There we go. Got a water wheel. It's kind of a neat detail. That'll just take me right back down. Maybe you create a waterfall or something, I wonder? It definitely that that spot looks like it'd be a water a water oh nothing here is magnetic but I bet I bet you feed water into that thing and it starts cranking there's slime there as it to stop you from getting up there should be able to just walk on you oh, not what I meant to do well, oh, hi. Kind of pressed the wrong button for a bit there. There we go. I did it. Why did I do that? Okay. So this thing's not rotating. And I th so I think this can be used as the same kind of platform as that, ultimately. But not for now. Climb. Oh. All right, we'll try this. Come on, man. <laughs> you can do better than that, Link. I believe in you. Yep, there we go. Ha-ha! What do you got? You've got a thing. Rupees. All right. No, no, no big deal, just saving the world, doing the unspeakable, getting a hundred rupees. 
啊啊哦啊。